Today's devotional can be found in 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verse 18. But we all, with open face beholding as in a glass the glory of the Lord, are changed in the same image from glory to glory, even as by the Spirit of the Lord. Alright, if we have an open heart and an open mind and open eyes to see, and a willingness to see the hand of the Lord in our lives, we will be able to see that through the atonement of Jesus Christ, we are changed slowly but surely by the patience and love of Heavenly Father and Jesus Christ. We are changed. And we at first might not recognize this change because it is so subtle. But as we grow and learn through the atonement, we will be able to recognize that as a glass filled with water, if we put effort into it, and if we put effort into leaning on Heavenly Father and Jesus Christ for help, our glass will be full. Our lives will be full, our heart will be full oh, of joyous nourishment that we might be able to learn and grow according to the will of the Father and according to our agency. And that if we make good choices, we can continue to see the hand of the Lord in our lives. And as we change from glory to glory, as we make those covenants and undergo those ordinances, that allow us to change and to progress temporally and spiritually. Outwardly, we are the same, but inwardly we grow and progress that when our body takes rest, we may be able to go into the spirit prison and reach out to those who still need help coming unto Christ for redemption and rescue. And it is by the Spirit of the Lord that these things are done, and if we enable ourselves to be in a position that we might feel the Spirit of the Lord, we will be able to participate in this wonderful work of rescue. But it's our choice, and we have to be willing to change ourselves before we can help others come unto Christ that they may change. So it's dependent upon our agency, whether or not we are an observer or an active learner and later a helper. And with that said, I love you all so very much, and I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.